what's going on YouTube it's EK here today with another division video and today we are going to talk about a very annoying subject that's in the division right now um, it's basically people who don't know what to do when they go rogue hunting and it's really annoying because it's it really pisses me and my friends off because you know, there's, there's a bunch of guys out there who love to go kill rogues. And it's fine. Like, I'm not saying you shouldn't. Um, you know, we like to do it too. But more often than not, when you have rogues with uh, high levels or even just manhunts and whatever, you often attract a lot of people. Right now, as you can see, you know, me and my, me and my team are going to go hunt down these manhunts right here. And there's at least four or five guys <laughs> like two other teams at least I would say trying to go and kill these guys right and what ends up happening a lot is that you know we're all going we all want to end these guys manhunts but what ends up happening is you know since we're down in this DZ3 court like kind of subway corridor you know what ends up happening is that we often end up going rogue on each other and for the most part like when my friends and I see this and like someone accidentally shoots us we generally kind of back off for a little bit, kind of monitor the situation and just, you know, kind of back off, right? So like, to make sure that they're not trying to kill us. And once we realize that they're not, we just go after the manhunts again. And the most annoying thing is that other people don't do that. And it's so annoying. So in this clip here, you'll see, you know, a bunch of us are going downstairs. We're trying to kill these manhunts right here. Like, you know, they just keep kind of killing one or two, fall back, kill one or two, fall back, you know, and they're pretty effective in pretty much uh, making sure that we don't get killed. Like, notice how I'm not killing that rogue right in front of me because I know it's accidental. I know he's not trying to kill us. We're all trying to go kill those manhunts right there. So I know not to kill him. And I know sometimes, like, auto aim will accidentally shoot him. But obviously, if I you know you, you're using your eyes so you see if you're shooting him you actually you know you're accidentally shooting him you you stop right like you just stop aiming down sight and then you move your aim somewhere else so you know we're chasing these guys downstairs and we end up going down this yeah this court this kind of small hallway here and it's pretty dicey to say the least you know where uh, we only have a small hallway to shoot each other they have and there's you know four or five guys on this side Half of us aren't even on the same team, and it gets pretty dicey. And basically, what ends up happening is that I end up accidental going rogue, you know, the initial 20 second rogue, and it sucks because, um, you know, and I'm like, oh crap, okay, there's other people here, so I'll, I figure let's let, let's back off, right, so that they don't think I'm trying to go rogue on them. But this one dude, this noob, uh, just doesn't know what he's doing. He's just shooting at everything that's red. And he ends up killing me, even though I'm not shooting back at him. I want to show him that, like, hey, look, I'm not shooting you for a reason. It's because I'm not going to here to kill you. But he just doesn't get it. And it's so annoying. Like, I can't. And it happens so often where, you know, man hunts and all these rogues get away. It's because of fools like this guy right here who will come back and shoot me for some reason. I'm not even shooting him. Look, I'm not doing anything to him. It's obvious I'm not trying to kill him, but he does it anyways. And, he, and I'm just like, what the crap is wrong with you? Like, I end up sending him a message and I'm just like, dude, you gotta shoot the manhunts. Like, why are you going after me? I'm not even trying to kill you. You're like, you're, you're, like what are you doing? And his response is like, oh, like, I've killed you before and you were easy, so, <laughs> and I'm like, what the hell? That doesn't, mean, like, that doesn't make sense. Like, obviously it's easy to kill someone when I'm on like 10% health and I'm not trying to kill you either. I didn't even push a health, you know? So it's like, what is wrong with you? And this is just like more like a public service announcement. For those of you guys who are out there rogue hunting, shoot the rogues that actually get you something. Like, don't shoot just any rogue out there, you know? Just, you gotta shoot the ones that will actually give you the points. Like, shooting a 20 second rogue when they actually haven't down anybody gets you nothing, and then it only gives me, and then I lose hella crap. Just because I'm, you know, um, just because I have that initial status. And it's bullcrap. Um, but you guys who are out there who, are like, you know who you are. Like, you know, you go rogue, you want to hunt down the rogues, but you end up shooting everyone. 
and you end up and because like you're stupid and you don't realize what you're doing <laughs> and you end up like you know shooting them down these guys that don't matter the real rogues end up getting away because I mean, a, a real perfect situation is where, so you have three groups, right? A, B, and C. Group A, you know, they're going to go rogue. They're going to go manhunt or whatever. They're trying to go as high as they can. And because, you know, they kill a few people, they end up going manhunt. And eventually group B and C, they're like, oh, crap, there's rogues here. We're going to go kill them. So B and C, they, they go kill, they converge on these guys, group A. And what ends up happening is, you know, B accidentally shoots C. Now C is, like, freaking out because they think they're, like, working together or something. And I get and I get it. Sometimes like there's multi grouping in this in DZ, but there's a lot less of that nowadays. So you gotta stop being so freaking scared of that crap. And so because there's so little of it, you, you should just go for the rogues. Like go for the real ones. And you know, so many times that you end up like just getting these these real rogues that they just end up getting away and they finish their manhunts and now like you're just sitting there with like nothing to show for it because you finally realize like oh yeah like no i don't actually get anything for killing these like you know non-rogues or not real rogues and you know you guys out there who are who are doing this stuff like some of you are just really young like your kids and i get it you're not that bright <laughs> no offense but you need to go for the manhunts like look out here we got the manhunts we got his friends we're just shooting them we're not shooting anybody else but them right you know we and I'm pretty sure it's because of these guys that we're fighting with. They don't realize what they're doing. You know, the manhunts get us, and it ends up just, like, us dying a lot. I think I lost, like, five levels in this series of games. And it was just so annoying to have these people who just don't know what they're doing. So, you know, just word of advice, you know, when you are when you guys are going to go hunt for rogues, chances are there's going to be more people there. And if there are more people there, just be very careful what you're shooting at, you know? And a lot of times, like, and if you're a rogue, like, you want this to happen too, right? Like, you you want multiple groups to come after you. I mean, it's a little scary at first, but if you can get them to go rogue on each other, it's a lot easier for you to either run away or just kill them because once they turn on each other, you know, you can start popping off grenades, throwing down turrets, you know, popping an alt, attack, a tactical alt, and then you just mow them down, right? Like, those, those things are so possible, so... For you guys that are out there going rogue hunting, just go for the rogues. Go for the real rogues, I should say. Go for the real rogues who are not, who are not 20 second rogues and kill them first. You can go kill each other on the other time, like after they're done, because those are the people that you know you get actual experience and credits from. So why would you go for the people that give you nothing? So, anyways, that's all I have for my rant today. Hopefully, you know, you guys learned something. It's been really frustrating for me and my friends. So I hope you guys, you know, uh, just get what I'm saying. And, you know, happy hunting out there in the world world. So for all you still listening, thank you very much. Uh, if you like what I'm saying, give this video a like. Subscribe and comment below what you think of people who don't know how to fight rogues. And yeah, let me know what you guys think. All right, take it easy, folks.